how to create a program goal. All right, so you are done with your program review narrative and now you are ready to, you know, create your first program goal. So let's go ahead and go back to that hamburger menu and you are going to go to your program annual planning and augmentation. The first thing you're going to do is click on this program goals tab and once you do that it is going to take you to this menu. Once you are here you are going to click this lovely little arrow that says add program goal explanation and you are going to land here on this menu itself. So I do want you to just take a little, like note of this and I just um, all you have to do is essentially fill it out right but I do want you to look at it so the first thing you want to do is put in your program goal name so please number and name your program goal in a condensed way this kind of allows goals to be easily categorized and recognized right so we have a, a naming mechanism and it is right here so for example you're gonna put 2021 update curriculum to industry standards um, whatever it is right but you're putting your your year there um, we want to know what it is like right away right so go ahead and make sure you read this completely and then the next um, thing that you're going to fill out is going to be your program goal explanation okay so you're going to describe in detail the meaning and intent of your program goal you're going to incorporate any action plans for how you will achieve this goal so um, this prompt essentially wants you to describe in detail the meaning and the intent of your goal okay so again don't forget to incorporate that action that you want the next thing that you're going to do is this uh, lovely little uh, resource request drop menu um, this prompt is asking you if you will be attaching a request for a resource to this program so if you will really request if you will be requesting a resource in relation to this goal we want you to select that option which is the program goal requires a resource request if you do not have a resource request to tether to this program goal, then you're going to select the option, this program goal does not require a resource request, right? So it gives you one of the two options. And it does tell you, you know, if you do have a program goal that requires a resource request, you're going to uh, have to complete tab two, three, and four in the closed the loop years. So that's the fourth year so you still if you are in the first year then you know you have three years to go but just keep that in mind um, the next little tab that we have here the next drop down menu is the term in which program uh, the program goal initially was proposed right so here you're going to indicate the term in which you are first pitching this program program goal so for example if this is fall 2024 you are going to select program um, uh, sorry you're going to select fall 2024 if this is the first time right and then status of goal so the status of the goal again it's another drop down menu but you're going to select the status of the goal which correlates best with its current situ situation right if this is a new goal you're going to select proposed goal in program review uh, but we have other sections as well right uh, this is a reoccurring goal it's a program goal achieved no longer a program goal other etc then you know if you have selected other uh, we do kind of want to know <laughs> about what you meant by other so here you have an opportunity to kind of explain what you think the current status of this goal actually is then we have a goal uh, prioritized priori my goodness prioritization <laughs> prioritization nope we're gonna move past it we're gonna pretend I said it properly and move on so here we just want to know the priority of your goal right is it a low priority a medium priority a high priority what do you consider this goal um, select that option which best fits your program goal okay um, 
I know that for like some of us, you know, we're going to want to put high for everything, but you know, let's uh, be realistic, especially in, um, in terms of like the other goals that you have as well for your program, right? Um, then after this, you're going to select the following that apply to this goal. Um, here, this prompt is asking you to select all of the areas of the campus initiatives and projects where your program goal might be applicable, right? So just, you are able to select as many as you want, but please make sure that they actually fit those areas, okay? And after you're done with that, you're going to click this save button, and guess what? You are completely done with this area, so congrats!